because now I'm getting a bit used to it, I'll need... I can actually see most of the actual uh, menu. Just a bit squished is all. In fact, certain things are a bit more clearer. Imagine needing to see everything. Right, we've got no money. But we do need to put resources where they belong. Uh, do I, uh, I'll put miscellaneous resources in the miscell miscellaneous box. Do I need some lantern? No, we got 117 lantern. Well, I think so. Yeah, got copper bars, got some chests, man. Yeah, put chests in a chest. I can take one. I'll take one. Yeah, take a chance. First PC game was Wolfenstein 3D. Ooh, very nice. A pet sugar glider. Is that any good? Stream looks super good today. Hey, Cultivate. I appreciate that because on my screen, it looks fucked up, bro. The suffering I put up so we can have good stream. Going to be well known because I'm going to complain about it every time someone brings up the fact it's looking a lot better today. Cosmetic buddy. Oh. What the fuck, mate? But I saw... I'm sure it was a jungle we saw last time, right? A uh, jungly jungle. But this is my, you know, resource. Sand block. Yeah, we put stones and wood in here. How come we can't stack things in my own inventory? Hold on, I same. Nope, that's palm wood and wood. Ah, you can stack above a thousand? Fair enough. If we need resources, we shall just blow pipe. Ugh. Yeah, I'm collecting resources so I can build anything I want here at any time, ever. As long as we've got a workbench, carrying it around, we're fine. Because I'm just, I'm just heading out. Last time, we did a mighty hole. Yeah, if I'm, because I've got my furnace here, I've got my my box. If I just leave a load of things here, die anywhere. Oh, blue. Is it going dark outside? Are we going to have to spend the night here? We could go underground. Time to look for some heart formations. I was going to ask how do I increase my HP. Now we've got a lot of fire arrows. Like arrows, same thing with stars. It helps with collection. Ah, uh, decent tip. Gel counts as ammo. You can place it there uh, so it doesn't take up uh, a slot on inv. Ah. Very nice. Thank you. What did the Irish meat boat captain say when he sip shank? Oil beef. Well, oil beef hooked. Where's me buddy old man uh, Humphrey? Don't know. Don't actually care. I'm in charge around these parts. HP increase just like Noya. What half on it? <laughs> what we find HP around on the floor, lingering. But we can't go out during the dark. I wanted to explore. I've got me hat on. I've got me armor on. Me wonderful green armor. This is my house. You know, I like to live rough. So this is the closest I can get to a house while living rough. You know, not many amenities. This is my home, away from home. That are hearts. Very nice. Thank you. Do you have a bed yet? Nope. Don't need a bed when we're living in the darkness, you know? We're waiting to ambush someone who dares come through these doors, you see? Oh, I can use bed to speed up time. Ah. I don't think I have the makings for a bed. I'll have a check. Probably not. 
I want a cactus bed. I can't remember what I needed. Can anyone remind me of what I needed for a bed? So we can speed up the process of bed. Iron, wood, and cobweb. Is, oh, is iron, wood, iron, and wood? Or is iron, wood a thing? Loon, cobweb, silk. Iron and wood. Ah. I'm sure we got some cob. Maybe I put cobwebs in miscellaneous. Oh, I need a loom. We need actual webs to cloth. We'll make a loom then. What's your favorite music? Uh, how do I make loom? Do I have to forge loom? Will my boy Levi tell me how to make loom? Make a chain. God damn. Yeah, there's a lot of intricacy in this little motherfucking game. Ah, maybe I want to be making. I've got an iron bar, but. Fuck up there. Oh, the tungsten ore. Maybe I should fuck with that, you know? I'm probably not going to need the ore separate from a bar, right? You know? Ooh, hello. Who needs all when you come on? Miss Noita today. Hey, the VOD's there, mate. And we did some amazing things. We actually got the thingy working, you know? Uh, to worry, work out some really nice builds in case you're a bit of a guy. But it's my first playthrough. I don't mind being slow, right? Chat's already going to speed me up from a natural point of view. Um, uh, of course. Things will be fucked. I suppose the anvil might be... Iron fence, weather vane, toilet, bathtub, trash can, a heavy workbench. Ah. Mine car. Oh, oh chain. Uh, build chain. I mean, this chain for thing. Do I need much chain? Because I don't want to waste any iron bar. Oh, I've got 15 chain. Oh. Hey. Just one. Nice. They always make a dedicated look. I'm trying. It's. I wish I could be in more, one chest at more than one chest at once, because I've opened it. I'll make a sawmill. I'll try. Cost me wood, iron bar, and chain. Can be placed. Use for advanced woodcrafting. Fantastic. Thank you, guys. I feel like I've advanced many, many times over. Yeah, I definitely want it here. Close. There we go. Oh, thanks, for like Now play saw. Make a make a loom. And we shall see about loom. Loom, 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 loom,
Blum, 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 blum. Hey, unfortunately I can't spam a nice little bit of uh, meow in chat. Too iron, thank you. But could people appreciate uh, this asparilla? A bit of meow in chat. I appreciate it, thank you very much. Did we use all our iron? There's the loom. Shit. Where was the loom? Loom, 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 loom. Your zombie worker is making pretty lights on there. No loom. Yep. Yep. Need some wood. Yeah, it's a bit of a problem when, you know, I can't access both these at once, but I'm sure. I'll get used to it. Oh, I need to be here, don't I? Loom, 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 loom. loom. Panic table. <laughs> A wooden yo-yo. Boom, boom, boom. A bar. Loom. Blacksmith rack, eh? Loom. Only cost wood? Huh. Oh, I made two. Made three loom. Uh, only cost me wood in the first place, so you know it's all fine and dandy. Hmm. Loom. I wanna make me a bed. 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 Wood is abundant. Weaver of faith. Dresser, mannequin, hat rack, weapon item rack. Ooh, star. Keg. Loom. You can build a loom with a loom. Or am I here? Ah, why straight it? Silk. I take it I need the silk. The silky things. You have weaves already? Mm. Yeah, it's a problem on Twitch. Oh shit. I might need cobwebs for other things, but I might need silk. But will it dig? <laughs> ah, so we made the silk with the loom. Any bed? Any bed come? Nope, nope. Pick, uh, maybe I could, I could personally sleep on a fancy picnic table. Sofa? Ah, oh, we're getting there. But no bed. Super rack? Oh, spear rack. I see. Hats. Top row. Ah, bed, 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 bed. Trap door. Ah, I might need a trap door. Wood door, chair, chest, wood table. Uh, oh, bed. I have made the ultimate in technologies. You know where I'm going to sleep? <laughs> right next to the player. Hmm. On the roof. Is he gonna steal my bed though? And put it on the roof. <laughs> ah, I got a demon eye down there. Quack. Nah, I'll put it up here. You know, I I'm ready for action then. You know, jump out of bed, jump down here. Yes. Bed. Anyway. I'm gonna put some stuff away and go on adventures. We've already got. 
You know, quite we dug a place to do a thing. I mean, we've been on a tree hunt, you know. We find a guy there. I mean, the Pac-Man tree. But we need to go and see the penguins again. Before there is holes to be... Oh. You missed exploration? It has happened. We did an exploration or two. So we have spare iron bar. More copper bar. Um, I might leave wood with me, but I can make wood at any point, really. It's just that, I, right, the three, I said, a th I need rope. We've got rope. We've got torches. I've got my pickaxe. I've got my sword. I've got my wands. I'm fine for exploration. I've got a chain. Um, I might leave chain in here. I'm not going to need chain, right? Put a chest in a chest, you know. Paxis can be placed. Yeah. Proper mine must be considered. Darkness is for Doug. <laughs> loom! I'll put my loom away in the miscellaneous box. Hey, if I need a loom somewhere else, you know. <laughs> I've already got two more. Hey, it's always best to have multiples of everything you need. Stop quacking away, guy. I've got shurikens, I've got throwing knives, grenades. I am armed and dangerous. Cobweb. Um, I'll put the cobweb. Even though this is a bit, you know, messy in here, we've got a few mushrooms. What lip? So. Yep, we're fine. Run! What are you fucking talking about? We shall adventure again. Adventure awaits. Thank you. Chop in the grass. Chop in the grass. Expert chopper of grass meat. This is why I'm all dressed in green. A good grass chopper always dresses in green, so they blend in and aren't hunted by natural predators. Oh, I need my... Where is it? There we go. Ghosty... Go. Ow. I'm an idiot. Oh, the wind. The wind be crazy like that. Ah, how is your check up there, Prescott? A lot more to do in Minecraft than the devs actually listen to me in Terraria. Oh, the angry timber. That's got to be able to be set on fire really easy, right? It's windy as fuck, so that's going to be super dangerous. Did we pack snacks? I've got a mushroom. Hey, I eat, I eat off the land, me, you know. I eat whatever the land provides. I'm under attack by degenerate folk. Not went well. Gums have been healing nicely. Fantastic. We're off on a windy sand adventure. Getting sand in my crotch in my hair. I'm just going to jump around. I don't need resources. Uh, I need to get out of here. Ah. You dare get out of here. Angry Timber was once scary, but now I am the one who dominates. That's a lot of money. The wind is obnoxious. I don't think I have enough imagination for games like Minecraft. Yeah, same here. You could argue why the hell not playing Terraria. Um, which, I'm not right. The one thing I'm, I noticed, and I haven't actually mentioned yet, there's been no story. At all. Right? There's been nothing apart from a few folk going, ugh. Yeah, as we know with Noita, story isn't essential when imagination exists. And the curiosity of the unknown. Squirrel! Oh, my face. Oh, Squirrel, I'm going to hide with you, bro. 
It's safe down here, right? Yeah. Maybe we start digging here. You know, maybe we... Maybe the squirrel's trying to show me something. Yeah, that's one thing I'm actually really liking about Terraria. I'm sorry, squirrel. You got in the way. So one thing I'm really liking about Terraria, you can go at your own pace and you don't feel like you're punished for it. Um, and it doesn't feel like you're slowed artificially down or anything like that. And it doesn't feel bad for being slow, you know. Rip squirrel. I know very, very little about Terraria. I've seen some of the places you can go because of Priskip and just looking at hell and stuff like that. Um, I've seen, I, like, Priskip was on a sexy rowboat that was re very reminiscent of Freya's rowing boat that flew. Very Nordic. Lights. Again, we're going to get stone again. What I really want is upgraded weapons. You know, upgraded digging. I mentioned this to Priskip while he was streaming. I want upgraded swinging power. Ah, hold. I knew this place was filled with a mystery. Just in case I need to escape. You know, can't be too careful around types of these lads. Oh, I destroyed my own room. He. Ooh, tungsten. Oh, very nice. Expert medium, I am. I thought I was on medium core, but uh, that's incorrect. Tungsten ore, though, man. Very happy to find any metal. Mainly because I'm a metal head, you know. At heart. Yes, I agree. Not moon. I fundamentally agree with everything you've said, you know. I could not disagree more. Incorrectly. As we dig our hole down, this is the, you know, dream of every child everywhere to dig a hole to the other side of the world. And this is what we shall do. Ooh, liquid. First, we must make our escape route, though. It's the one thing every child forgets. Get stuck in a hole that way. This is good. Although the sand will collapse in on me. Oh, not me, torch. Yeah, this is progress, though. Anytime we make a hole, we make progress. The fact we've got rock above us is huge. I'm just trying to find precious metals and resources. And then you can all backseat me into building, which actually is going to be probably the meta for us, right? I go on my adventures. I find things, right? You all back at the home. Have a little gander at what I've got. Suggest what I build, and uh, we benefit greatly because of it. I hear that, renegade. Yeah, exactly. Uh, it's all cross. Thanks for the follow, man. It's going to be the best way of doing things. Oh, dear. <laughs> I mean, I am wearing armor, so I do sink a little bit. Uh, looking good. Hey, thanks, uh, Tarver, and welcome to the chat, dude. It's Tarbar, not Tarbar. We have a Tarbar. We have a Tarbar. No. Tarbar. <laughs> but we are adventurous. We are, you know, holding our own in the world of adventuring. Ah, potion. Oh, my face. Not the face. Ooh, is that copper? 
Oh, lesser healing. I'm just gonna heal naturally. I'm just gonna chill, you know, while it's, it's raining outside. Breadcrumbs and a memory of... Uh, where was I found? Where that was found? Make a pro. Oh. I don't want to get collapsed in on. This needs to go. Although I might make a little ledge for myself to, you know, block this liquid so I can dig this way. It's got more oh, bloody hell. Fresh torch. Yeah, as long as there's a bit of rock above, we'll try and follow a rock-based uh, existence uh, without getting collapsed in up. As I get lower and lower and lower. Listen to that storm. I know it's scary. I am confused greatly about the fact I'm in a hole and no water's coming down here. The fire aids in healing. Yeah. Thank you very much. I suppose it's just the extension of the campfire idea, right? So, we always need our escape plan because I've seen flying things that I'm terrified of. Yeah. I still always have an escape plan. Have some gravestones and iron. Oh, if you have some gravestones and iron, there's an upgrade for Diggy you can make. Ooh. Once I'm done with this adventure, I will surely do that. Because I don't see myself going too far down here and living. <laughs> you know? <laughs> the entire point of this place is uh, there's many dangers. You can't just dig forever and not get punished. However, can I dig to a certain point and get rewarded? That's the question. It's the delicate balance we're operating on. I just want to go deeper and get some pog equipment. Resources. And digging straight down would be the best way of doing it. Oh, you bastard. I've got seven torches, which is actually really good. I'm not sure why I cursed. I love that sound of making a <laughs> little rope in. Yes. But do you like my tunnel system so far? I do. That cobweb? Oh yes. Love me some cobweb. I'm very glad I bought a lot of rope, because this is the this is probably the furthest I've gone down. Hello. Oh! Yeah, recall and whatever that potion was. Oh, mining ore. Dead block, dead block, stone. Yeah, that's platinum. Oh, platinum. Any platinum. I can't believe we haven't found an enemy guarding this platinum. You got me? Uh, the game needs to guard its precious equipment. Oh, baby. I mean, if you're going to find anything, platinum is one of those that is... Uh, you know, if you compare it to real life platinum, pretty pog. Ooh. This is what we get for our adventuring rewards. This is why we're here. This is why we do what we do. I don't want dirt and stone. I'm kind of over the whole dirt and stone thing. Was that an enemy? We we're close. Seven enemies nearby, by the way. I nearly fell to my death. <laughs> Get back up. <laughs> oh, there's five enemies nearby now. I'm assuming they can't fly, otherwise I'd already be dead. Um, is that danger liquid, I wonder? Ooh. Oh, no, it's a glow stick. Uh, oh, hello, red slime. So long with levitation. <laughs> well, he's not dying. Oh, there's a heart down there. <gasps> Fight or die. 
Oh, that's a shiny. Ah, do I have to smash the heart or something? I can't see it very well. Hmm. I can see it. No, I can't. Smash the heart. Oh, life crystal heartbreaker. Burns. We get in platinum or platinum or platinum or. Sorry, it worm. That's a lot of platinum ore. And some copper ore. Oh, shiny. Consume. And that could have been easy to miss, but it was pretty obvious. Defend myself. Defend my own honor here. Eat the heart. Did we not eat it? It said I consumed it or something. There's still material to be gained. Oh, I know what you mean. Very nice. Hmm. Oh, yes, I got paid. <laughs> um, luckily, I didn't get wrecked. Hmm. Yeah, that net is actually really helpful. One more copper. Silver. Mining potion. Oh, look at all this. Are these glow sticks you found glow underwater? Ah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. I remember being able to throw them. It's just the resources, man. If we get resources now, we might not need to get it in the future when we are building specific things that advance that plot. There's so much around here. So far, wonderfully. <laughs> oh no, it's not happening that. Eventually we may run out of rope and be forced to return. But yes. <laughs> what? Oh shit. Um, ooh, don't just get hurt. No, no. First trap? Yeah. Well, that's second, actually. Um. Dark trap. Ah. You might have, I do have a recall potion. And I'll consider it when I am nearly dead. But for now. I've been collecting around these parts. It's been so productive, I'd rather die <laughs> than uh, give up. That's just dirt, right? Mud block. Fantastic. So, um... Hmm. Ah, I think I see it, but it looks just like a regular block. Could I have used the no-trap seed? Did they only fire once? 
Das ist der Poison Deutschen. They have a permanent form. Yeah, I think I've seen it. You hear that noise all the time, you know? The folk are doing. And, uh, you know, more. Uh, A good morning, insisted. Perhaps a triggering. So, would you like to? Can we not dig underwater? Or is it just harder to dig? Oh, yeah, I've gone. Yeah, thank you. I went precision mode. <laughs> that was too precise. Whoa, you bastard. That banana? Nope, that's a worm. Ha! Huh. I shall smite thee! I did all the fucking work now. Beautiful. Deadly and dangerous worm, we fend it off with our heroic activity. I'm proud of myself, of course. It came from nowhere. The a dirty on us. Where's the worm blood? True. Seeing in the dark would be pretty officially cool at the moment. Followed by a bad man. Can you actually get he's fast? Have some of that, man. That sand again. Yeah, this this is basically cheating this. Abigail is. <laughs> so that might have been a sandworm of some sort since we found sound. I'm sure, could not say. I want to find gold. I don't know why. Uh, I, I don't know. Every time I see sand, I'm like, oh, it's not gold. Abby, Abby is, you know, a babe. First big titty goth girlfriend, of course. Always got a summer cake lying on the couch. Get a fucking job! <laughs> I'm gonna fight. And be bury you. Yes! Bravery! Personified. Beautiful! The bounce. I don't need more than one, but I'm trying to. No, that's gonna bounce. Oh, hold on, there's resources down there. I can see it. We've got a bad man. He's coming for me. Rope it. Do we need to build? Oh no, we can cart it whenever we want. Why do you need to build? Why do you need to build a cart if you're automatically given one? That's my big question. Of oh, resources. We'll work out from here and grab all the resources capable of sustaining us. Yellow slug! What is this wall fungus? Come on, that is perfect accuracy. What? I hit him right in the fucking dome. 
Oh, building can't go faster. <sighs> oh, yeah. Oh, gel and copper. Aid. Right then. What the fuck is that thing? Oh, it's... Squeaky. It must be harmless, it squeaks. Ooh. Oh, the sauces are so sexy. Pot. Don't sand me in, bro. Just want to get to this ore without really having to jump up and down. English squeaks not necessarily harmless. True that. There's one right next to it. That is a huge mother slime. I'm glad. Oh, Rawley, the traveling merchant, has arrived. Um, should I recall to get him, or do you reckon he'll stick around while I'm adventuring? Do you reckon he'll stick around at least once or twice? For me. If he's a traveling merchant, right, he's got to stick around. That's just what merchants... Oh, he's a bone-throwing son of a bitch. Have a girl. And a skeleton with his hand. He stays for a day. Thank you. So I'm not gonna... I'm just gonna grab some ore here. We can always come back here. This has been so fucking productive. Yeah, I'm not capable of fighting that, really, am I? Abigail is the greatest vapor sister I have ever had. You want prescription to co-op? Yeah, I've got to learn. Gotta learn some things. Rope and tungsten ore. I need to spread this water out, but yeah, I mean... One, hopefully the 4G can handle it. I mean, I've been able to do stuff like the Notice Summit before and stuff like that, so I don't see why not. But, you know, as long as we can make it entertaining, that's all I care about, of course. Ooh, is that mother's... Oh, this is perfect. Got... So much ore. Want to rush Yeah. Well, this is it. It's the primary enjoyment from a new game is going at your own pace. The problem with, you know... Introducing another element, such as co-op. Pace can change very easily based on certain parameters, so... It's a good call just to chill for the moment. Oh, I can just climb anyway. Ah, uh, bum 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 bum. That red slime should be ignorable. Um, no, it's just... Oh dear. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. We've only got a day. I mean, I'll be making good money here. To be fair, if I go from legendary to expert game, we'll feel too easy. True that. Bit of a weird one, you can go in. Oh, hello, K bat. No, we can ignore that for a sec. Oh, copper. No, it's just stone block. It feels like there's other things on there. Cobweb. I'm stuck on a cobweb one. Nah. Luckily, we're just torching up at the moment. Ooh, background change. Yeah, get some lanterns down here. I need to see them coming. 
Oh, we're in a snow bike. Oh, yeah. Let's do some digging. Oh! Very nice. Get some copper. Oh, silver. I have imperiled myself in a hole. Some silver. Oh, you son of a bitch. That is not that bad. Other game is just gonna wreck you. <laughs> Rope swing. Get it. Amethyst. Oh, I see it. Oh, shit. I'm sorry, what? Did I get sand dropped on me? But that wasn't an amazing amount of damage. Must be sand. was one mighty successful hole. Uh, I use a recall potion. It seems every cave I go into I get one anyway. But heading out the hole is going to be so much quicker, and I wasn't that far away from home. I actually just have the torch out, right? And why we love rope? I'm not surprised. Rope is love, rope is life. Oh, it's very bright out here. And it's light as well, so... We go grab our money. I'm going to need to go to war, though. We are. Ah, uh, black. Oh, swing and a miss. Sand slush and some other blocks do have gravity. Yeah, it's a bit... Be expected, really. I can see the comparisons tonight are in the small details in terms of, you know, the minor connections in terms of, you know, obviously Night is a very falling sand game, while this is, you would suppose, a minor, a very minor sand falling game. Ooh, how you play? Thank you very much. Run! I feel like getting a bit murky out, you know, dark. We have bed now, though, so... I want to build a pyramid. I want to get all the sand together and build a pyramid. Worthy of no... Oh, you know? Archery competition! <laughs> oh, I shot. Hey, French. All... Off you got. Lawn Flamingo for five gold. Ultra bright torch. I take it torches won't have the same angel halo. It's the only vanity item, though. I mean, she got the sand, the glass, so you can turn those mushrooms into proper healing potions. Ah, vanity item. Oh, a star princess dress. Ooh. One platinum.
I take it it's 100 gold for one platinum, though. Awesome! That. Since I mine platinum, platinum ore, can I actually mine platinum? Duality can be placed. Into your shepherd. Hmm. Why not? Torch, ice torch, ice torch. What the fuck? Uh, platinum equals 100 gold, not sadly. You can't mint platinum. Co fuck off. <laughs> purple torch. Ooh, sexy purple torch. You know, after black. Purple is my favorite color. Glass mug. Wine glass mug bottle. Snowball. <laughs> Did I do damage? Yeah, I didn't do it. <laughs> yes. Ooh, platinum bar. I might as well make some platinum bar, right? I might as well make bar of all kinds, right? But yeah, I can't afford the shit he's offering at the moment. I said that, since you can get a platinum brick and a platinum bar, I suppose they're interchangeable though, right? You know? You can change a bar to a brick and a brick to a bar. Because you could with... The wood. <laughs> yeah, you can do it with wood, so you can do it with platinum. Bar, better than ore in most cases. Oh. Yeah, why would I make a house out of platinum? It might be defensible, but... I just want some raw material bar, you know? Like, a lot of everything. There's, uh, right, I really think there's going to be nothing to do with ore. And I want to concentrate on the bars at the moment. Then we can concentrate on the... Do you want to show that you're a rich boy? Yeah, check out my bar, bro. Terranium! Yeah. Is that? Glass. How much glass do we have? Is that most of my glass, though? No, it's 16. Ooh, acorn and apple. And what's stone brick? a lot more intricate things we can make now. Too many, really. Again, it can be... This kind of stuff can be really overwhelming, you know? There's a way to undo things you eventually find. Well, here's the thing. If I need, say, a brick instead of a bar, I just go out and find more, you know? I mean, the game might be limited on resources because it won't regenerate the world, but... When you're starting out, I really doubt there's a problem, you know, concentrating on one thing, eventually to concentrate on another thing. Probably. Not to be confused with getting bricked at a bar. I saw someone get glassed at a bar once. It was right, it was stood right next to me. Cleared out the bar and everyone ran away from the bar and I got server really fast. It was great. Like, uh, the thing is, because I have long hair and I was at a bar, like, for really fucking degenerate people, like street people, you know, tracksuit people, you know, don't ask me what I was though, um, I don't know either, like, I thought the guy, the guy could have been after me, but he wasn't, it was after someone else, and as soon as I didn't get attacked and someone else did, I was like, well, it's not concentrating on me, what's the point in running away from the bar, I can get served now, because the bar was packed. 
Timmy, ages ago, dear. Are there uh, many ways to get things renewable now? Oh, nice. Oh, roll it. A trouble in motion has departed. Fuck you. Need you. Platinum bar, though. Oh. It's a good haul. I'll put glass in here. The other chest is getting a little bit... Tungsten bar again. You have any gravestones? I do. I have plenty. <laughs> gravestones. Uh, a tombstone's the same as gravestones because then I do have a few. Not an amazing amount. Less than I thought. Place them down. What, in my home? That's a bit grim. <laughs> right! Things will get spooky. What, in a good way? Yeah, I've already had a ghost attack me. You know? So, uh, is it like the night a ghost? Or I get fucked on? Wait, like, why would I build it in my house then? <laughs> if things can't spawn in the house, though, I could have put it on the roof. <laughs> Safety roof. That way they're not spawning inside. Glasses are for civilized drinking, not for seating disputes. Don't care for your spirits. Say no to our call abuse. Oh, it's for your digging upgrade? Ah. What, I need to kill the ghosts? I take it. Something like that. I, uh, can I, uh, I shouldn't do it in here. You know, the self contained home with no one, you know, in. That way, if the ghost spawns directly at the thingy, I've got them contained immediately for Abigail to fuck them up. Sounds like a plan, doesn't it? Or does it need to be in my home? Need to be in a graveyard. What? My home is built on a graveyard. Ah. I make a graveyard biome, placing a lot of gravestones. Ah, I see. Exclamation will do. Fuck, fuck laser, you know? <laughs> oh, 8, 10 to 10, gravestone. Um, will this work? 
In this graveyard on the ground, how's it fucking about it? Ah. I need to build a... More. A tombstone, gravestone, the same thing really. I assume I can pick them up and destroy them anyways. Well, you know, pickaxe. Them. Ooh, stop. Uh, so we going on a graveyard hunt? Yeah, I mean, that might be priority. Because I want to go digging. I want to go all places. I'm going to sit with... No, I don't want to talk, mate. Sit. Turn the fire on. <laughs> Run away. <laughs> I want to sit without turning the fire on. There we go. Cough platform. Is a platform kind of transparent to my body? Like, well, it's the whole point of a platform that you don't actually get it interactable with your hitbox, but you can put things on it. Because that is actually really fucking useful. If that is the case. I need to sacrifice yourself a few times to get more. It'll, it'll happen. Oh, push down, fall through. I see. Yeah, I might want to... I mean, this is fine for the moment. I just need to make a big F, you know? <laughs> or make... No, what I'll do... I'll just enheighten this thing, you know? If I enheighten... I'm a builder at heart, right? If I enheighten this thing, build it, I can build a big F, and then eventually an F with three prongs, like a fork. An F, like, maybe make a secondary thing. Hang on, it'll be fine. Yeah, not allowed platforms anymore. I'm just, uh... You know. Platforms have not become necessary yet, so I will make sure everybody suffers the lack of platforms. Along with me. So many dirt. Ooh, tungsten on. Pop. Might need more torch and I definitely need more rope. Problem is, until you've actually learnt all the, uh, you know, things. You first start looking at it, it just looks like, you know, image soup. It's a throwable rope, it's not the same. I'm gonna ruin most of the rope. Why aren't they fucking alphabetical, by the way? You know? Uh, since we're in adventure mode at the moment, might as well adventure around. In heighten, technical term, yeah. Just in heighten thing. I just want regular rope. How the fuck did I make regular rope? Because I've only got 65 rope left, and if I go on adventures, I'm gonna run out of rope, and then I won't be able to rope anymore. And that'll be a tragedy. I could ask Levi if he's got, you know. Brought it. Oh shit, yeah. Let's get a raid on piggy bank and buy rope. Ah, uh, the silver might cover it. Oh, it humph. Oh. 
Yeah, I've put five in it. Right, this is gonna be interesting. Oh. Can I multi buy? <laughs> Amazing how fast your finger fucks up. Whoops. <laughs> Not like I say. Um, yeah, at least we confirmed the purchase. Amazing crafting, but it comes uh, later. Nice. Oh, nice. Thanks. Oh, dear me. That's ah, fine. Shit. That'll do. Hey, adventure awaits, my friend. So we're gonna... Again, the more rope we have, the more fire we have, the more we can adventure longer, harder, faster, stronger. I'll be right back. I'll be like, literally 30 seconds. I just need to... Unfucking myself and get a beverage and... We'll be all right back into it. Adventuring the weights. Everything's running in the background, though, right? Everything needs to be... Uh... Uh, I think I'm gonna have a couple burrs for a full armor set. Ooh. Ooh. Anyway. I'll get, I'll get to that when we're right back. See you in uh, 30 seconds. Is copper better? All right. The mission is to look as metal as possible within the scope of, you know, hair must be as visible as possible for supper buns. Where did you put all that rope from? <laughs> yeah, the problem. I have a problem with wearing the full set. You know, the problem is it covers my hair. We've got an anvil tip, sir. We've got an anvil. If it needs a better anvil, though. Oh, fuck. Oh, no tango today. We've got the upgraded Fanta. Any more expensive orange? I'm gonna plug your phone in while you drive. I'm gonna listen as much as I can. Yeah, hey, stay safe, though, Cultivate, you know? Cheers, guys. I should be... Uh... <laughs> yes! No worries, cool, but you stay safe, dude. I like my emote. It has both my hat and my hair. But yeah, right. Project. Um, we roughly know, and are being guided towards fa right faster digging, because digging is a big part of my adventure here. Getting places underground. Me right. Eventually, I will adventure into the sky. Fire. Means of infinite rope. I'm just gonna rope upwards. For however long it takes. Pardon me. But faster digging, we'll get that. Fuck laser, man. <laughs> um. But yeah, apparently something needs to happen for vanity experience. The problem is my anvil is too far away from my actual resources. Or the copper. Yeah, that is two defense versus the one defense, I think. Immaculate house? It is. Thank you. I'm glad someone noticed. Yeah, one defense versus two defense. Is one defense really that much? That's 14 melee damage versus the copper broadsword. I think you finish the whole game on stream. If people keep enjoying it, I will. 
If I continue to enjoy it and people continue to enjoy watching it, well, those are basically the two parameters, right? You know? I'm not going to play some on stream that people like enjoying, so. That's not exactly how you grow as a streamer and how you provide entertainment, right? You know? If no one's enjoying it, you're not providing entertainment, so what the fuck would you still do? <laughs> I mean, if your goal is that, of course, you know? And that being my goal, that's my kind of rule. So. It is one a lot. Depends, probably. Yes, depends. Not so much. Oh, probability. But again, it depends what you're into streaming for. I state my goals very clearly. You know, I'm pretty open about it. And the two rules, do I enjoy it? Does the, uh, you know, audience enjoy it? I'm here to entertain the most amount of people possible. At all times. Well, you know, there's a bit of leeway in that. Like when I took the Dark Souls holiday, right? You know, and to get hit on the view count, but I wanted a fucking holiday, and I played Dark Souls for the first time, so... Well, boo. I never finished Dark Souls 3, which I should have done. Um, one defense, one less damage taken. I mean, that might be up to 10%, you know? But with the replayability of Terraria as well, I mean, there's no reason why it couldn't become a mainstay of the channel, along with Noita, you know? So... That's what I'm hoping. I'm hoping people get into it as well as myself and, you know, we just continue playing until the end of time. <laughs> or until, you know, shit happens. I don't think I need the helmet and greaves. We're not wearing a helmet anyway, we're wearing a vanity rain hat. But the leggings themselves, which the greaves would be the leggings, I assume. So I think we just mix and match. Oh yes. Get our extra defense. The whole set gives a bonus. I don't give a fuck about bonus, mate. I'm here to look good. At all times, having my hair flow in the wind. Until I am able to get the thing that gives me the vanity option. I'm not worried at all. If we die, we die. That's... I'm not here to meta the game. I'm here to have fun. I know a lot of people on stream. This is why I'm allowing back seating, but I have limits. Because if someone just tells me the meta all the time, that's not the way we're going to work things, you know? One, my when I'm out on adventure, I'm going to go where I want. You know, I'm going to do what I want. I'm not having a go, by the way. I'm just explaining how we're doing things here. Um, it's important to me, you know? Because I think for the entire community, I want to kind of cure, make sure I curate it in a way, because it's easy for a community and a game to get away from a streamer and it go in a bad direction. So, uh, a direction, not maybe a bad direction, but a direction you don't want it to go for the, you know, profit of everybody. So, I'm not having a go. I just like to overly explain things to me. And voice time running around my house because I like the kind of big circle of house I made here, you know? Like, I'm gonna have a speedrun uh, world record time around my house, you know? I need. Oh, like Carl the car going, <laughs> going around in a circle. But, you know, backseating for specific things that I want to advance my gameplay, like quicker digging, aesthetics, that kind of thing. Things that are going to save me time on the tedious things as well. That's really helpful and I'm really thankful for that, you know? <laughs> Look at this. Half mud, half wood. I mean, talking about aesthetics. Um, I think we go sleep. Actually, let me ditch all my things. We'll go sleep and then we'll adventure awaits. Right, then. We've got a lot of bullshit. Let me just sell a bullshit to... Well, no, I need my hammer, don't I? Ah, do I sell my green, though? I might put another chest down. I know we can have an armor thingy. I put my chest down. Fuck. Shovel is good for saving time, but I don't know how you get it. Exactly. <laughs> the problem I'm facing, just don't know. You know, there's many things that can be done, but I just don't know. Uh, what we do know is we've got rope. We've got torch. We can dig. We can go and collect resources and... I've got copper. That's a lot of wood. Yeah. Build the cop. What? Did I buy two of these? 
Hold on. Yeah. Yes. I think that's a bit of a nasty habit on controller I've got at the moment. Accidentally and two things at once. How much platinum bars? We shall find out immediately. I kind of like this copper chain mail along with the green pants. I'm looking very farmer-like, right? Flat bar seven, isn't it? Ah. Nine. Nine. Nine, 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 nine. Hell six. Propaganda. Almost enough for a pickaxe. Oh, I like the sound of that. Hey, one more adventure and we should upgrade everything. Hey, my pickaxe is everything, man. I'm back, uh, back on playing Nazush. I have never heard of that, my friend. What's it about? What's it like? Things are getting squished. Copper bar, all right. Oh, it's, yeah, I accidentally did uh, 20 copper for an accidental... Saying that, can we... If you... We put our fucking armor away. Shit. If he buys... Does he only buy weapons, though? Because I'm sure I've sold him armor before, and he's like, nah. He, he takes it, but he doesn't give you any money for it. I think. Fucking <laughs> laser. Good question. Pickaxe goes burr. Yeah, I was jealous of Priscuit yesterday burring his pickaxe. If you got 999 balls, you have a lot of bars. <laughs> That'd be true. Well, I don't like carrying money around. Dangerous. Um, is an obelisk basically a gravestone? Yeah, I need another chest. I'll... Hmm. Yeah, I'll put a chest... I've got two chests up there. I'll put two chests down here, you know? It can be non-mining thingy, you know? And then we can just, uh, you know, start by putting the chest in the chest. Yeah, now we'll put the obelisk down. I should be throwing acorns a bit more, shouldn't I? Danger sense. Nah. Nah. I don't give a shit about tiki torches. As long as I got my glow sticks and I've got my torches, I'm happy. Boom, Shanko. Obelisks are gravestones too. <laughs> you make it sound like obelisks are oppressed. <laughs> Slot it down there. You know what? I think I'm ready. Go bed. Ah. <laughs> oh, check out bars. I mean, check his uh, ingredients list for things or something like that. What do you mean, crafting or? 
Oh, I see what you mean. Get the iron bars, highlight them, and see what it was all about. I mean, I do have a lot of iron bars. Ooh. I mean, I, I, I kind of want to be a jack of all trades here, right? Because being a jack of all trades, I'll be able to learn, right? Lamp post, trap door, hill, tall gate, chest, arm wood chest, arm wood clock, bra wood chest, bra wood clock, rich mahogany clock, rich mahogany chest, ebony clock, oh, should be a shovel, ah, shovel, 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 shovel. slime chest, meteorite chest, eh? marble, marble, granite, 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 granite. crystal clock. I thought that was an uber piggy bank then. A balloon clock. Bathtub and bunny chest. And pumpkin chest. You mean this? So this can attack and dig at the same time? Or is it just... Oh, digs a bigger area than a pickaxe. Only digs... Oh, soft tiles. Can you dig it? Ectomist? Not yet. <laughs> Ectomist? Oh, yes, yes, yes. Anvil and Ectomist. I see, I see, I see. Oh, cool. Nice, thank you. Yeah, I, I didn't see the actual other parameters. Get dug. It's great for digging dirt because... Yeah, sand and stuff like that. I can imagine there's a lot of sand. Hey, kind monster, it goes very well. I feel like, you know, every day we play this ta ra ra we uh, make adequate progress that each episode has a nice little uh, bit of meaning to it, you know? I'm sleeping. <laughs> Just like that. Go from prone to attacking instantaneously. Would you like to sleep? You see this? How fast I am? Oh, you know? God damn. Always ready. Sword next to the bed. Who am I? Andrew Tateman? God damn. Uh, it doesn't do stone, but it's amazing for dirt. Yeah, imagine having the shovel and the pickaxe. Especially if you upgrade your pickaxe as well. That'll be it. Top notch. Accelerates time a bit. Yeah, it's a good sign for beverage. I like how we're just being looked over by a ghost. Watching the sleep. If you, right, if you sleep during the day, does it accelerate day as well? Because can you waste the day by oversleeping? Adventure awaits. I think we're... Yeah, we've got none. I mean, yeah, I'll put the stars away. When I get back, I'll probably just... Because I want to be a jack of all trades. Is there... Right. Is there a certain... Is there only a certain amount of mana you can get? If I turn stars into mana, will there be a time I can no longer consume the mana... Thingy. Yes. Good times. Adventure awaits. It's raining. Luckily, I've got my rain hat on. Chop the grass. Chop the fish. I don't know whether I want to go back in my hole. I kind of want it. Right. I saw. I don't think I've been hurt by these guys. Right. It's not exactly a forest we found. But... 
four trees did feel a bit like a jungle biome. I don't know. Uh, you would have to increase uh, using gear if you want to go beyond that point. I see. I see. I thought you meant actually... Uh, I don't know. I don't even need wood, really. Jungle. It is a large wood. I'm getting that feeling. But the game does really well at allowing you the feeling of exploration with little equipment. Because when you first meet a vulture, they fuck you up. But it's not long until you're able to deal with it and then feel like you're actually going places and doing things. It's dark. This is where I dug last time. Ah, oh, we could keep on going down there. There was a mine cart, right? Yeah. Yeah. Whee! Proper spelunker, me. A stack of wood, there's a house in your pocket. It is. I've got a uh, workbench in my pocket as well. Ready and waiting. Just in case. I already know the answer to this, but... I've seen... Ha uh, I think Priskip's built a house underground, so I think I know the answer is yes. That you can build a house underground. Yeah. Run away. Get a defensive position. Tear them a new one. Yeah, Ghosty can solve that solution. Bullying! Yeah, we built a rope down here, but... Oh, I see it. Oh, dear. I'm gonna get light down here immediately. Skeleton, bro. Oh, what the fuck? It's a cute sound. Ah, oh, win the day. Just win the day. Oh, amethyst again. Fantastic. Light down. Not an insult, but a love. Non pro play. Hey, no insult taken, mate. That's the entire point of what we're doing. I like to face reality with an open face. But this is it. It's not. You only get a certain, as a streamer, you only get a certain amount of, you can play dumb as a streamer, right? But you only get a certain amount of time as a amateur, really, that's true and real, you know? And I like it. Because, especially the way I play video games, I do not get many opportunities for stuff like this. Well, I'm a thousand hour plus kind of guy in video games I enjoy, so. We'll pop. Whoa. So the rarity of this occasion is well founded. Should check Amethyst at Levi when you're back. Oh, aye. I should do that for everything I find. <laughs> I really should. I'm just stood there thinking, what should I do now? Oh, Amethyst. I do like the fact that any new resource or kind of, you know, metal resource you find is like a super event, you know? And it's like, oh my god, look what I found! You know? This game does that really well. Because of the implications of each of your materials for your run. Can you even follow me down here? Oh, yeah. Ambush. The worst type of bush. I don't know what you can make with stuff, check the boat. No. Dude knows everything. Why doesn't he get involved with building houses? You know, I'm with this. Well, 
they either can come down here or they can't if they make up their minds, that'll be it. Which I appreciate. Maybe if I get close, I'll have to go sort of Oh, shit. I said, again, if I just swing, the pushback on this is so great, though. Gel. Magnusa boss makes, uh, makes me feel like I'll suck at the game again. Yeah, Terraria seems to have done a great job in many aspects of the game. I, for one, am very impressed. And again, just kind of seeing it from a very loose third-party perspective when I have watched the game, it's been one of those that, of course, watching it, you're like, I should play this, I should play this, you know? But knowing the scale of the game, knowing how many hours you got to put in as a streamer, you got to pick your time and moment. And January of all time, New Year, fresh year, feels like a perfect time to play it. Especially because, uh, historically, right, and this hasn't happened this year, right? Because of HS Saga for Neuer, normally January is a time after Christmas where all numbers for streamers go down, right? And it's a really lean month. I, again, this is kind of generalization, of course, but and it depends on certain things. And it might not just be HS as well. It might just be, you know, you know I'm so fucking good. But no, I mean, you know, a lot of Nutty streamers are getting the old boost because of HS uh, and the interest in the game again for certain mysteries and secrets. And just high-level play, of course. So even without HS, I was still thinking about a good Terraria. In fact, with the whole HS thing, it made it a non-optimal time to play Terraria in a way, but... I've spoken about Terraria for so long and wanting to play it that, you know, sometimes you just have to shut up and put up, right? Sill? It's not sand. It's not stone. It is a very nice change from Neuer. It is. And I had to give, I had to give Terraria its fair chance because of the amount of hours you can put into it. And the chance for it to become a mainstay on the channel if people enjoyed it and what we do and how we play it and how we, you know, produce entertainment out of it. I had to give it its chance eventually. And I couldn't hold off anymore. Oh, you bastard. Oh, I'm drowning. ahead play Terraria during the whole HS thing because I didn't want to deal with it. Hey, I'll tell you what though, um, go into my Discord on the Eyes and Cauldron section and check out the most recent link. Read into it and let me know what you think. I told them to, you know, if they want any help and support in certain areas oh, shit, of what we're doing, that you're, you know, good at certain things where I'm not, shall we say. And to consider you. Well, oh shit, again. Oh, I'm gonna die if I'm not careful. But if you fancy it, let me know what you think. Again, no pressure. Again, it's one of those that, uh, with the eyes being so heavy, on many a shoulder, stop it. <laughs> crisis, <laughs> crisis averted. I keep on putting myself in crisis. <laughs> Sapphire! Very nice. Yeah, this is what I wanted. I wanted to make it a bit shallower and give myself a ledge. You know what I mean? See, that's nice. That's really nice, isn't it? Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah, drainage. Yeah, that light should work. Mm. <laughs> yeah, okay, but yeah, we now drain it and make it a bit more. Hold on. Hold the phone. There is no phone to hold. Sorry, I lied to you. Uh. 
Oh. It felt more deadly than that. Okay, you fan. I look into it, but I don't like collab with people because I don't want to solve it. Nah. Oh, if we don't solve it, um, I can't show up. I won't spoil it for everyone. True. Yes, don't get pushed off here. And true enough. I want to find more of those. Want to find an emerald before us and all that? Woo! Oh, that was perfect. I wanted that one to. Whoa, I thought that was an enemy. Um, I'm not gonna die. I fall down now. Good. Oh, another minecart experience. Beautiful. Oh, I keep on messing up my torches. But it's fine. Hmm. What I need is a parachute. It has a decent community too. Well, this is it. Like, I used to watch a bit of Badger play and I never understood the game. But Badger was a great personality anyway. He was such a cool dude. Really welcoming, Ooh. really welcoming fellow. It didn't matter, you know. Oh, platinum ore! Build the road. Ah, oh. how it feels. That's a lot of ore. Yeah, this is why I don't like just jumping um, when there's technically somewhere else to go. One, this gets me lower, so if I make a mistake, it doesn't hurt as much. Potentially. Oh, giant shell there. <laughs> what are you spinning off the eight? I guess it would have done. It's more just, uh, you know, if I use a well, if I use a rope instead of digging it down, I could have missed that platinum ore, for instance. So it's better for me at the moment if I'm gathering materials to not just rope it. And if I get down to a place, you know, I've naturally dug down to, if possible, might present a bit of bonus for me. Mud the slime and uh, some beast. Can he fly? Oh shit. Oh, you boss. <laughs> hmm. I might need to do it here though. <laughs> yeah, make a little uh rope net. I've got enough rope to the thing is, if I miss pressing up at the right time, this is why I'm building rope nets, by the way. If I miss pressing up, you know, and there's enemies down there, I want a rope net that I can have a bit of leeway with. I mean, it's not hard to press the up. I'm really happy this sword is paying dividends. You know what I mean? Out of girls doing food. Very nice. That's what we're looking for. Again, we'll go with the other way. Do not worry. Do not concern yourself. I mean, what are we doing? Just get up on the fucking car, right? I can 
build rope on rope? So you can kind of waste material quite easy here, it feels. What world type did you choose? Uh, medium, eh? I don't know. Summer. What is it, expert medium or something like that? Expert medium world or something like that? Or something about ilk. Oh, thank you, Prisca. I highly appreciate that. You know, I'd do it myself if I was. <laughs> if I was an incompetent. Oh, shit. Oh, no! I've been rummaged. Rummaged? Yeah. At least viciously on the cobbles. Get up. Good. Saved. Want that? Obviously. <laughs> yeah, what a way to build a rope. Tell you what, some beats get made out of this game, don't they? Yeah, I wanted to be up here just I said no, I connect beats. I don't know where there's definitely a light over there, so having a connection. Should be good. Large world can definitely get overwhelming. New terraria. The small world is too small. Place a rope on top of rope. Builds it. All right. This may save me some trouble later. Don't know. There's going to be some loot down there, though. But I feel like, you know, I barely even tapped the surface at the moment of explorations. So. Definitely got a very large feeling about the game. I don't know for damn sure. Hmm. Yeah, I don't mind actually falling here on the system. Oh, for fuck's sake. I just want to mine in peace. Because it feels like a combination of several games, like Spelunky, Noita, maybe even Minecraft, I suppose. 2D Minecraft. Ooh, Flix and Pearl, whatever the fuck that is. <laughs> I like how you can jump into Minecraft, though. That's a bit shit. Oh, cobweb. Oh, a piranha, eh? Can I stab a piranha? But they're gonna vicious. Oh. I'm not getting a chance to fight things myself. <laughs> yes, because it's so often fish. Oh, Ooh, ice block. I don't need an ice block. What I do need is rope coming down from here. Yeah, controller is not precision. Um. And of course, I'm going to waste a lot, but, uh... Oh, dear. Hello. Well, as long as I'm not viciously attacked anytime soon, we'll be fine. That was a big fall. Yeah, I don't want to die. I want to continue living my life. 
Oh, yes. Yeah, <laughs> get more torch by smashing open. Professionally done. Um. Yeah, it's a nice roundabout way of doing this. Definitely want that copper. I need to defend myself. I can only do so at the moment because Abigail's busy. Ah, I did get pride, Abby. This is such a haul, though. I do this for myself. And I get my torch back at the end of all. Undead Viking? Yes, because often well-known fact that Scandinavian countries existed in Terraria. And, right, a person from Scandinavia is not a Viking. A Viking, like going and being a Viking was like an activity. You know, you went Viking. You know, I don't think you went Vikinging, but you went as, like a Northman would go as a Viking. Basically, Viking means warrior. Ooh, we're gonna fall if I don't. Play. Oh, this is nice. I like. Oh. You know, he went worrying around the place. Bit of an odd word, Viking. I, think. I don't know what he dropped. He dropped something. But, uh... Ooh, a sapphire. That's all that offer. Oh, uh, material is so fluffy. I feel... Oh, spiked ice slime. Copper ore. Mining pants. So, let me get this right. I can get the benefit of something, say putting it on here, while getting the aesthetics of something else by putting it here. Is that correct? Even though, yeah, I want alternative pants. That is fucking cool. That is such a cool way of doing it. I'm fucking super impressed with that. You see, that shows care and attention to detail that most games don't even bother with. Mainly, you know, once you become millionaires, it's a lot easier to pay attention, you know, to <laughs> little details. Um, I don't know, so, but you know. You've got less worries and the ability to like, concentrate, and that's what I love about, you know, when game devs receive a lot of support and are able to do that, you know? You have the ability just to pretty much... I mean, life always has problems, and you're going to be concentrating on multiple things during life, but you know what I mean? It's the ability to throw up a few problems with cash. Many final updates has Terraria had? Oh, are they always doing stuff? I mean, they were meant to have their final update years ago with the, their final update. Come in. I made a hole big enough. Ah. Come as a Viking, you know. He will leave as a dead man. 
Can I Goomba stomp people with this? You know, that would seem like it hurts. Ah. I don't want to test it out in well, at the moment. get cheeky with a rope. I like it. Oh dear. Oh. Oh, I hear that, renegade. Eh, yeah, broken. Thank you very much for following. I appreciate it. We're slowly rolling. Rolling, rolling. Oh, thank you very much. Welcome to the chat, dude. I'm just letting my, you know, the lady ghost and deal with all the problems we have. I hope you're doing well. Ah, Viking man! Oof. I just want to chill. Oh, that's all shiny and shit. Why am I. Am I shiny or. No, I think it was a rock shiny. What the f is that a ball of yeti? All I shine shit, yeah. For all bastard. <laughs> <Get out! laughs> all of the effort. I love the hole when they're above you, you saw them over your head and this goes flinging away. Wanted his fluffy willow. He hit like a train. Fuck. Well, it is what it is. Dying is gonna be an essential part of this. some bars. That's a lot of fucking amethyst. Yeah, I think I need to... Sapphire. Look what it did to that cat. <laughs> it is what it is, but not happy about it. Fluffer material. Silt block now. I'm unstoppable. 
118 stone. I mean, that was a proper adventure. Shame we died and couldn't get out, but... Ah, fair enough. Um, <laughs> yeah, the quick stack, eh? Levi! Look what I found! Stained glass, multicolored stained glass. Looks so good. You can make a large amethyst from amethyst and amethyst. Great. This is not like Noida, though, Dan. Yeah, it's not as savage. I think that's why. If you die in Noida, of course, you go right back to the beginning, but with a few unlocks here and that. Not many at all. But this, you're not losing your progress. It's why it's so kind of accessible in a way, while being, you know, complicated. Oh, I'm assist. Fuck me. You know when you know you've got something but you can't fucking find it? Because you're really shit at organising everything in your life. Fucking got it. Boom! Movement unlocked. Is it like a grapple hook? Where you can just yeet yourself around like worms? Armageddon? this movement uh where was it built in the amble where does it go ah, ah hold on time eh? Um, how does one use such a thing? Well, we should put our stuff away. Uh, should be a special key to grapple, not sure. Oh, fuck me. Slush cactus leggings, we'll put them away. Ah, uh, not here though. I have no idea how to use on control. Ah. Huh. If I press my left stick in, I can go on fire straight away just to hold it out. I take it that's our favourites. Well. I'll press all the buttons in a while, don't worry about it. But it's getting dark outside. Problem is, if we only die underground, I mean, I'm gonna go back to the place. Oh, bunny! If we only die underground, LT maybe? Maybe. I have not checked fluff. I should. 
Button mash and gauge. I should check fluff. I should check everything, but I'm being not lazy. I'm just being, you know. Like I've explained before in pre one of previous episodes, where, you know. Oh, that will help. Offer a nice moving game. I will increase your maximum life. <laughs> Thanks. Ah, put a coat. Why would you need two fur coats? Who's that? Deer thing? Summons deer clops. A demon altar. Great. I have a lens. I have fluff. I do not have demon eye or. I've got a workbench. I don't have gold bar though. I might have enough gold to make gold bar. A singular silver coin. I have nine gold. Great. <laughs> get out of here, hit the roof, get out of bed, go in. I want to get back in my hole as soon as possible. Grapple around. Let's yeah, advance night a little bit. Sure, you about a good bar. Nothing. Yellow Sakura. Maybe I need to raid my piggyback. Is it my uh, gold made it a furnace? Because I've got the plat. Got me all of nine plat. I love the basis. Yeah, I like it too, man. Very, uh, renegade style. It's got its own functionality, right? It's got additional accessories that can fit in here, right? You know? I can enheighten the whole thing as well. And take off the roof, build the roof bigger, and start stacking more of these sticks. Fuck platforms. I like physical things that can stand on and not fall through by accident, right? Um, oh, that's great. Oh, yes. As long as you don't near a door. Oh, yes. <laughs> Rapple! All right, it's got its limits. Ah. Yeah, as long as you're not... Oh, I don't want to... Gravestone. The strategically placed grapple points, yeah. Get away from the door. <laughs> Able to grapple and glow. Um. <laughs> yeah, so strategically placed. It's all by design. And it's hanging it around. Oh, yeah, I should carry the piggy bank around, really. Um, how do I pick up the piggy bank? Do I have to mine it, basically? Like, destroy the table? <laughs> Instant access. <laughs> oh, beautiful. You can destroy just to piggyback. Ah, 
Hammer time. Oh no, that'll destroy the background. carry the piggyback around. Until you get through and destroy the table. Defense. Need like a spiky tar roof or something like that. Don't worry, Humphrey, they'll be gone soon. Just doing my daily round. Oh, hello. I'm helping. Oh, they're running away now. Cowards. Use it as a weapon. <laughs> I'll head out early in the morning. Ah! Bird. Oh, bird. Sorry, bird. Hold on. Oh. 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 <laughs> Grapple the bird. Uh. Oh, run out of fire arrows. Hey, hey, hey. Still a bit dark out. Do we dig a new hole or continue going through this? Yeah, we wanted to go to see the minecart, and this has been so productive so far. Can you eliminate fall damage by doing that? Like, if I'm falling, can I just grapple the floor? You know what I mean? And eliminate. I I'm sure you could. <laughs> oh, yeah. So if I'm falling, just strategic grapple. Very nice. You are right. Movement is unlocked. We never... Oh, we did come this way, but didn't at the same time. Ah, we never continued down these paths. Accelerate towards the ground, okay. <laughs> uh. Oh, shit. That's fantastic. Let's jump on that. I do not want to destroy my thing. Oh! Intriguing. Hey, it's first time, actually, fifth time Terraria. Hey, it's first save Terraria. That's the first time in my book. Oof, that HP. That's looking, that's feeling a lot better now. Although, it's only going to give you this for a reason. You know what I mean? 
It's only setting me up for a greater fall in the future. Some good cob women. Beautiful. I, I mean, that is just the uh, best chamber ever, right? Right, Abigail, go. Sort them out. Getting strong. It's like overly extended Rocky montage with all the bits in between, you know. Oh, well, dropping by before I need a bed? Nah, Fleming Joe. It's been good, man. It's been a good stream. We learn about math <laughs> in Nighter and how we're getting fucked. Although we made our wand, sorry, our heart farm very well produ produced. We're going to need to do better. We're going to need to organize ourselves. Have bigger capabilities. Yeah, it's been a good day, man. Hey, Rage. How long till Legend HA runs on Terraria? Two weeks? Yeah, something like that. Ah. That's a very satisfying sound. Oh, hey there, O-A-T-T. -T. Hey, Casey. How you doing, man? Welcome. Hey, can we get some love and meow and chat for Casey? Cracking, dude. Let me get ambushed in. Run! I hope all is well, dude. Dude's, oh, dude, he's coming down here. No. Oh, my God. I mean, I'm getting tungsten all though, so I really win this. This fight. Tungsten is... Oh, Amethyst as well. A little bit of Amethyst. Oh, Sapphire, sorry. Ah, even better. Only got one Sapphire. Yeah. Beast. And thank you very much, Casey. It's appreciated, bro. Doosh, 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 doosh. We're farming. Everything we need to farm for... I'm sorry. That's a new one. Kind of enjoyed it. So we'll tread lightly. Yeah, of course. I mean, that was a nice douche, 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 but in quick, rapid succession. Ah, hold on. Yeah, that's, what, that's awesome. I like it. Yeah, we did it in a safe and wonderful manner. And it stopped so before it killed me. <laughs> I kind of want to go down there now, though. Almost breaks ankles, but, you know. Some magic or other managed us to uh, save our life. Son of a bitch. Ah. <laughs> That's the way I do it. Oh, that's awesome. He dropped some. Oh, money. Oh, you can kind of hop off it. That's nice. Yeah, we're on a mining expedition, and uh, I will not be stopped. Cannot be stopped. Cannot be tamed. Yeah, sapphire. I'm finding loads of sapphire. Free. I'm sure I saw it glow purple over there. Though. I'm not sure if I've ever asked what's your preferred controller? Xbox. 
Xbox One third party controllers. Le ice. Oh, it's a slush block. I need slush. Yeah, yeah, yeah. As opposed to Xbox controllers, sorry, PlayStation controllers, which feel like, you know, you're not even holding a thing. Xbox ones uh, generally feel like somewhat substantial. Diamond will be hard to see you or make uh, for the best crystal hook, I see. I'll keep my eye out for anything shiny. Slush. Right, ah. <laughs> I'm suspicious of everything now. Oh. <laughs> yes, <laughs> Beautiful. Now, getting the grapple has been... Really quite nice. I know there's still tungsten there, but effort for that one. <laughs> Moving on. Uh, yep, yeah, there we go. I don't know what I'm holding on to, but it might be something. Yeah, a good way of getting away from enemies as well. No grapple, I suppose. Nice. PS5s have some weight to them. I don't uh, find it to be as amazing as most crack. The amount to be, yeah, I just... I used to play on PlayStation before I played on Xbox. After PlayStation 2, I never played X, uh, PlayStation again, mainly because PlayStation after Xbox, sorry, after PlayStation 2 in the PlayStation 3 era ended up leaking literally everyone's information. Like, really badly, and I never trusted them since. Also, the controllers sucked. And it, as soon as I started playing Xbox controllers, you know, they, actually, oh, fuck, they actually feel kind of weighty, they've actually got some substance to them. And I just never bothered to go back, I just got used to it. And, Never needed to uh, bother too much. That's not a shine. No, I think that's just the water shine, isn't it? It's like playing the fucking xylophone. I see you. Is that just slush? No, I wanted that. All the ore must have all ore, otherwise we're not doing a very good job. Yeah, you can't break the thing that you're attached to, I think. Which is pretty convenient. I'm gonna get whacked in the head soon. Uh, silica desiccants. Thank you very much for following. Uh, this hole is the biggest hole we've made. Saying in real underwater life waterfalls. <laughs> in real life underwater. <laughs> Jesus. Savage. That's going to hold a torch for a while. Well, see. That's just how we roll. If you like the third party Xbox controller, uh, Razer Mirage Ultimate is worth a look. I don't pay more than £20, £25 for a controller at a time. That's why I go for third party controllers, cheap ones, because they're just as good. They're pretty much officially licensed by Xbox in the first place, so good or bad, you know, m more money or less money. They're up to a certain standard. Yeah, it was, it was nuts. One of my mates was... One of my mates at the time was all about... Well, he had both. Um, Xbox and PlayStation, I think. Definitely had a PlayStation. Um, and as a general smoker, he got very paranoid. Oh, dear me.
Yeah, might as well. Stop it. Some of the higher end controllers. No, do I have certain advantages like uh, Wolverine? Has multi level triggers. True, but I've had those kind before and they didn't impress me. They don't add much to what you do, personally. Um, if you got used to it, yeah, maybe. But if you don't get used to it, you don't know what you're missing, so I don't care. You know? <laughs> I'm one of those people. Do not mind being a basic bitch. If you can find contentment in that, then you're winning, really, aren't you? You're not paying for the privilege of feeling the um, advanced lifestyle, shall we say. Yeah this, oh, Jesus. yeah, this grapple's really cool. But just dodging. <laughs> like, when it comes to controllers, the only thing I care about, or would care about, would be the sticks. If I could get a better stick that didn't break, you know, over time, I'd pay for that. I'm not paying for anything else. You know what I mean? What is it, the holographic versus the actual kind of... What's the word? I don't know. There's different types of sticks, like configs, though. And some are so far superior to others. Because, obviously, the main ones that are used, even in regular, well, proper, um, you know, elite controllers wear out after about, you know, for me, it'll be about three, four months and they'll wear out. Even a elite controller, I'm pretty sure they use the, uh, the more basic setup because it's cheaper. And even in the elite controllers, I don't think they oh jeez, I don't think they fixed it, or at least didn't bother to, you know, think the uh, improvement was worth it for the people that are giving them a hundred fucking two hundred dollars. Um, that is a minus one against Xbox, but to be fair, PlayStation ain't much better on that front either. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, Mona Lisa. Nice torch. We've got a home away from home. We never need rope ever again. In cupboard. Man of almonds. Badly. <laughs> Have you uh, tried, tested a Steam controller? I have not. Again, I'm happy in the ways of Xbox and controllers, third parties. The thing is, like like in video games, like I've said, like when it comes to platforms, I'll use it when I need it. If I need the upgrade, I'll go for it. But if I don't need it and I'm comfortable where I am and I can entertain people with what I've got, there's literally no need. Like... If you were at a certain level of comfort with something, you technically might be able to get more comfort out of something else and maybe like a slight improvement. But me getting a better controller isn't going to improve your experience. Right? And to be fair, it's not going to make me a better gamer. That's the con that they will tell you. You're going to be an elite fucking, fucking gamer if you get this controller. It's bollocks. It's actual bollocks. And it's all marketing, and I'm not falling for that shit. Was that a chest? It may be. I need to break in. Ooh. We got an extra later. Do you like to fuck off? I'm trying to search it. Box. I'm going to steal that box as well. Silver coin, ice torch, archery potion. 
Okay, okay. But the extra simulator can be placed material placing sil slush fossil piles into the accelerator turns them into something more useful. Oh yes. Thank you very much. The thing is, to loot this, I'm gonna have to destroy the floor. Maybe not. Sorry about your floor, mate. Don't know whose this is. I have a great controller and still shit. <laughs> well, this is it. You, I'm just a poor bitch, right? Who gets by with, you know, whatever I can. I'm happy to do so. If you've got the... Like, here's the thing, right? If I had the funds, yeah, I'd upgrade. I don't need to, though. It's not my mind. And if picking out, you know, things that I need to replace every three or four months, because I, I, you know, I work my sticks hard. Put it that way. I don't treat them fair. So it's going to need replacing whatever again. So I just go for the cheap option because they're actually pretty damn decent at what they do. The response time's fine. Everything like that. There's no lag. This is general Xbox controller, in it? Even if it's third party. Not getting the Mona Lisa, can I? Oh, shit, yeah. <laughs> Nurse Lisa. Elwood kiss. Yeah, ransack. Ransack the place. Fantastic. Thank you for reminding me. I can steal everything. My internal pillaging mechanics uh, are a little bit off. Thank you for reminding me of such a thing. An ice torch. Sounds pretty cool. Need to... About... Oh, that is pretty. Very blue. Yeah, I also live up north. <laughs> Should be stealing the art in the background. Hey, we got that. Is that another gem? I think it's copper, isn't it? I'm referring to this. Copper oil. Yeah, good, good copper. Dog. All right, you take on one, I'll take on the R. You take on both of them. Yeah, the house is just a trap for these dudes now. They'll never be able to get it out. <laughs> Here's the thing, though. The one thing that is true... Right, I've got a story. Story time with LST. I used to play a lot of Counter-Strike with mouse and keyboard. <gasps> I know, shock horror. That was fucking good as well. Not great. I was good. I never got great at CS. I was great at count. I was great at Modern Warfare 2. Fucking free for alls, mate. I got a. I can't remember what my streak was top three on free for all, but it was fucking huge. Also, you know, got that 10 nuke streak on free for all. Anyway, controlled. You know, Modern Warfare 2. Um, but you could run mo an old school Counter Strike. You could just download skins. You didn't need to do this fucking loot box bullshit, right? You could download a free skin, change your gun, do what the fuck you wanted. It was free, it was beautiful. They changed it. Counter-Strike sucks these days. Um, for changing the mechanics and trying to make it monetized. Fuck them. You know? Hate that shit. Can't stand it. It used to... The early internet was beautiful in so many ways and they ruined it. Um, and early gaming, you know? In online gaming, anyway. So, there was a thing, right? And it goes into a lot of different things. Just hit me out. Where... Stop! <laughs> Just hit me out. Um, where, if you... Right, you aesthetically changed the gun. You also changed the audio of that gun. You did not change the accuracy, the firepower, anything about it, apart from the aesthetics. However, when you changed the aesthetics into a more beefy sound or something that was more enjoyable for you, that gun then felt better. It felt like you were better with it. Despite the fact it was all aesthetic changes. So I really do buy into the fact that A, if it makes you feel better and you can you can placebo yourself into actually being better at gaming. But it's not the actual controller itself. It's you. Right? You need to believe in yourself and what your own capabilities are. It doesn't work on me because I know I'm good. Right? But you know... If you need to buy into the fact that it sounds good, and it feels good, yeah, it can make you better. And if that works, that could work for anything, right? 
That goes into so many different things. Like a controller, for instance. Blue. I like it. I like that blue. I'm going to change back, though, because I want to save them. I think you're just super lucky. <laughs> it's possible. Hey, I mean, you can't discount it. I mean, there is limits to that, right? How lucky you can be. Kind of. I mean, some people seem to have their luck stat turned up to 11. What the? Seems like a nice place to chill. I'll never understand the fetish of what keyboards sound like. Yeah, I don't either, but, you know. To be fair... People are going to like what they're going to like. And whatever... Whatever sounds nice to people, whatever feels nice, I can't blame anybody for anything. And I'm sure you don't either, but, you know. It's, it's a lack of understanding, I get it, you know. I'll be the first to claim ignorance on many things. Oh, I'll tell you what, this has been... A wonderful expedition. Oh, my face! Not the face. <laughs> Slam into the axe. Uh, yeah, Easter on the shore. Yeah, it's absolutely. Uh, not to defend microsite actions, however, for the amount of time resources needed to make flagship games now on a day. Um, considering how much. I mean. No. I'm not buying that whatsoever. Personally. And again, I'm not saying you're wrong. I'm just saying... Games as services is the most bullshit thing you've ever heard about. Make Right. Indie games prove this all the time. And again, yeah, if you're making AAA games... Well, here, no, it's kind of bullshit because God of War. If you make a game good enough, you'll earn the money and the revenues to make, obviously, the second one. You didn't need microtransactions. You didn't need all that shit. It's still a AAA game of amazing quality and value. Um, it's a scam. They're bullshitting you into cl claiming they need it, in my opinion. I, I don't know all the details, and I'm, again, I can't say you're wrong, but I can't say you're right either. And I have a different opinion. Uh, isn't it a sustainable model anymore? Game company has allowed inflation over the past 10 years. A $60 game 10 years ago would be around $200 today. I think that's a bit of an exaggeration. But I see a point. It really depends, because maybe the game devs, instead of looking to monetize their game in what I would consider foolish ways, maybe they should look into making games differently. Instead of, right, here's the problem I have. Why automatically go to the profit motive through dickhead profit mechanics, why not change the way you make video games? Instead. The more moral high ground version. Right? You know? Because they don't have a fucking moral high ground to stand on because they're not those kind of people in the first place. Business is always about the bottom line. It's always about the money. So that whether they bullshit you into thinking they need to do this. And again... Again, depends. Like, free to play games, fair enough. You know? I don't have to buy it. There's certain elements where you could argue, yeah, it's absolutely fine. For microtransactions and stuff like that. No argument, because it didn't cost anything to buy the game in the first place. Um, but it's certainly not covered itself in glory as a uh, method, methodology of financing a game. Because that takes effort. True. I mean... It's just the limitless potential for money making for them. How much money did they need? You know? 
there is no upper limit to the amount a person can normally pay on these games. Like Fallout 76 and shit like that. The amount of money that you could spend in that game for, like, again, say $5 for a skin, shit like that. Now, here's the thing, right? Say back in the day, Counter-Strike, indie people, right, independent people, independent from Valve, made skins, right? If there was a monetary system to pay the independent person so they could get funded and make more, fantastic. But giving Valve more money? Fuck that. You know? Don't Just don't make the skins in the first place and allow the community to make them for free. But no, you have to monetize it because it's a money motive. Again, it's more the uh, either pay to win element or. Uh, who's the monopolizer? Um, it's more Nintendo, isn't it? There's sometimes a mechanic from game devs that stop modding and only the d dev of the game can mod their game and then they monetize that, right? And that sucks. I only about it if the game's free to play. They, they, at least they've got a leg to stand on. However, a lot of those games are addiction mechanics masquerading as games. And it's just gambling. Or it's basically just like a slot machine, right? Flashing lights, click the button, flashing lights, give us your money. And within that... If it's not protect... I mean, they should have a fucking warning on it, you know? Saying this is a gambling machine, basically. Or at least, you know. Alright, I don't know if you ever played that Simpsons kind of... Not farming. Like, you know, remember Farmville? There was a Simpsons game for your mobile that you could kind of build your city and shit. And it's like, oh, do you want to buy donuts for money? That you can build faster? And it constantly just harassed you, you know? Into trying to get your fucking credit card details. That's just scummy. I can't stand it, you know? It's, it's, ba Renegade. it's badgering, right? It's it's not a game if you are being badgered for your financial details. That is a marketing scam, really. However, you know, gotcha game. Hey, we'll get your financial information. Hey. Hey, Dalaskim. Thank you very much for the follow, dude. I mean, there's a reason. And there is on the rise. Absolutely. And again, a lot of indie games show exactly how it's done. And they somehow manage to keep existing. Or oh, indie games come together, collaborate with, say, Noita. Three devs come together, make a bunch of money, and go away. And, and fuck me, they made a great game. Everyone's had a great experience. And the end. Fantastic. Art. Right. In a way, video games are art, and art should have an ending, right? I mean, not always. There's exceptions, but... The, this is the problem I have with video games being services, you know? It stops the video game being art. Because you, you, the dev never planned to have an ending to this. There is never a finished masterpiece. It's just, what's the mechanics we can introduce into the game to get your cash? There may be good ways of doing it, and I can kind of understand a defense of it, but only to a certain degree. Because 95% of the time, it's implemented dishonestly. And it makes, you can't really, you know, fuck you, fuck you, fuck everyone all around, you know. I mean, I wish someone would, although I'm not really kind of bothered about it anymore, you know. I've got better things to be getting done than getting fucked. Hey, yeah, but I hope you get fucked on the daily, man. Out of left field? Yeah, sometimes it is, mate, you know. I mean, if, se if sexy big titty goth girl came to you on the bus and like, fuck you, it's like, really? Is that an offer? You know? Hell yeah. Out of the blue, but surprising and nice. As long as they've made it a priority to wash that day. Whee! Yeah, it's all gravy, isn't it? Can't be having that stank, you know. And stop, there's always something on the B button. <laughs> you gotta 
fair bit of games in recent years that have been really well liked. Made by one or six people who don't cost an arm and a limb. Well, this is it. I mean, go on. Fuck. I need to save my HP because I'm getting wrecked all around. Although I shouldn't die from that. Yeah. Stop it, Ice. I'm down. Exactly. Everyone's down for a bit of loving. <laughs> or a bit of fucking, you know? Loving can be fun. Oh, shit. I need to go hide. Son of a bitch. Am I just hanging out here? Ooh. That was out of left field, wasn't it? One HP and a dream. I'm going to build some rope here just so I don't fall violently. <laughs> and they will come. I mean, if I'm not using rope anymore, I can just use it to, you know. Hopefully this is a closed environment. Oh, it is. Beautiful. Oh, hang in there. <laughs> yeah, I will. I must be loved every time I turn around someone else is trying. <laughs> Forget, uh, you can do it, but uh, button mapping. Uh, when it comes to button mapping, it doesn't bother me as much. Normally, the default, especially for a game that's been out this long, is all right. It might not be optimal, but you get used to it. And with my fingers being very professional, Kind of doesn't matter because I'll just bend my fingers to the will of what it demands anyway, eventually, and get professional at it. Eventually, it just takes a bit longer, doesn't it? Did you play Dark and Dark? I did not. I have no idea what it is. What's it all about? Is it good? Is it all right? So how do you justify the same prices for mediocre games? Just because graphic good. Um, you don't. <laughs> you just hope that they get trashed in the reviews and people don't get scanned in by them, I suppose. Although, here's the thing. What is a good game? You know? It might be a different response from different people, so... What the majority find bad, there might still be people who like it, you know? So, there might be still some value there, but... It depends. Oh, Platinum Orb! I like it, I do. Can we recover that? He's been quite nice. Beat him up! It's not a lot of Platinum. That's enough. Like Tarkov, made a baby with Skyrim. <laughs> Oh, it dripped down and nearly killed me. An ice bat is sparkling. That intrigues me, doesn't it? That amethyst made it seem... That am amethyst shine before made it seem like this was filled with... I'm not, I'm not sure actually got what I thought I was going to get out of that. It matters not. Again, the amount we have produced in material today and how far we've gone. Because obviously, a, a well-designed game like this, all you really need to do, well, especially when it is concerning resource gathering and killing, just adventure. Why do you think I prioritize adventuring instead of looking over the fucking menu 20 times every day? Um, even though I still do that a little bit. You know what I mean? Just prioritize an adventuring. <laughs> The more you adventure, the more you'll learn, basically. And inventory will come along with, you know, the more resources you have, the more you'll learn the inventory eventually anyway. Because if you don't have an inventory of material, you're going to be pretty slow on the build-up of uh, inventory possibilities, right? Whee! 
Hey, you can light up a cave really quite quick with the old uh, grabber. Really more of narrative games and not a pile of nonsense. You see in free games. Yeah, see, I think God of War set the standard with narrative games. Not even DLC, you know? Not even needing DLC, because it's such a complete game, you know? Fucking incredible. No loot boxes. No online mode, which is a bit of a... Ah, oh, well, how would you even, you know? Is that blood? Oh, you got oh, poisoned. It's got wrecked. Why is it blood? Or is it just the light shine? No, I... Yeah, the one negative here, you need to kind of mine it to see what it is. I can't do that with liquids. Blood moon. More like that. Whee! Oh no! We must get to the goodies before anyone else does. Yeah, I like this cave, though. Is this the cave people were saying early on? Oh, you should get to a cave early. A specific cave. Cave! It's got a lot of good... You know, a lot of good... A lot of good uh, goodies. I can really see why people want to get me here early. Something special lies below. Inevitably, it does. Well, I know you can keep on going down in this game, so luckily that is the least spoilery uh, thing. <laughs> I do know about the wall of flesh and shit like that, but I kind of... Oh, shit. Ah, that's what you meant. <laughs> I mean, I was thinking more in general, you know, bigger terms. big landslide. Is your display very dark? Because that was fairly visible. Yeah, my display is dark for me. You can see, you can definitely see more than I can see. We learned about that in Noita, um, where people were saying, there's a heart there. In the dark. And I was like, what the fuck are you looking at, bro? And eventually I clocked on that. Yeah, you can definitely see a lot more than me. Which is good. I, I, I kind of like that, you know? Because the community doesn't outright normally... Sp Again, sometimes... Here's the thing, right? Because there's a little bit of a delay on the stream. And I like kind of missing things. On, not on purpose, but I like by design. I kind of... Normally, by the time someone said something in chat, I'm already gone. So it's kind of like... You missed that. I, I still have the opportunity to go back. But I also have the opportunity to say, Oh, it's, it's gone now. You know? And it kind of just works. You know? That you get the information, you can decide as a community to say something, not say something, you know? Or, I'm already gone, you know? Or, oh, that's Snowflinks. I need my... Lady. Uh, we'll just snatch him, there's not much there. But it just works out very nice. You've got two Burrell now. I'm not sure. Yeah, well, was, let's just ditch a few things if we can.
How do I confirm that? Or do I just exit? Oh, you bastard. Has he got, has he got an American football helmet? <laughs> oh, piggy bank, yeah. Do I need, I take it I need to drop that on the floor? To be able to add stuff to it, or do I just highlight over it? Ah, it's on the floor, doesn't it? Piggy bank. Let me piggy bank. Unless you can only place it. The one immediate thing here, if I can't place it here, my first instinct would be you can only place it in your house. Platforms and table surfaces. See a man about doing that. Yeah, this guy is gonna hit like a prune. Oh, chandelier. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. He's got the wall. Oh, bullet. Okay. <laughs> we've got the fur. Right then. this on the ground? Oh no, I, I think you can only pick it up when it's empty. Unfortunately, I didn't bring a table with me. Platform. Oh, you mean something like there? Oh, I can't see shit. Ah, there we go. Thank you. Very handy. Oh. There we go. Thank you all. I'm going to grab everything. Now put the painting in a piggy bank. Put a chest in a piggy bank. Oh, I've got a wood piano. Cave bats having a bit of a righteous one. Hey, we got a fuck ton of gold here. Yeah. Alright, for this adventure. Sword. Sword statue. Not even a real sword. What's this? I don't have a platform. Just get everything. Ah, uh, you see, I didn't mean to make a platform. I made a platform myself. Hey, bloodbath! What the fuck does that mean? I don't even know. Uh, achievement unlocked. We bloodbathed everything up. Oh, I see. I have used the platform now. I am wiser for it. Blood Moon survived. And steal all the fancy chandeliers. Ah, don't worry, I'm way ahead of you. 
I assume Blood Moon was gonna survive. Door! Ooh. Oh. Loot the Burrell. Burrell? Burrell? Same thing. Blood Moon Pass. I'm the wiser. It was going to happen. Slime is falling from the sky. Intriguing. Maybe we'll learn one day what the fuck that's all about. I don't think today is that day. Well. Ooh, Amethyst River. I don't want to be on a fucking car. Deposit the cash, we have a shit ton of cash. Too much, really. It's irresponsible amounts of cash, considering where we are. And these guys are about to break a map of All of her! Grenade, maybe? A bit of carry grenades? No, oh, it's fine. We got a hook. Got a bomb. Um, overall likelihood of killing myself by a bomb. No, oh, dude. Fire hole! First bomb successfully used. Um, that looks like a very fucked up chest. All purple and shit. I'm scared. Kill 100 slimes and you'll anger someone. I was probably gonna end up doing that anyway. <laughs> and we shall see. Give me a heart when I don't need it, thanks. Um, hmm. Oh, this location. This kind of frosty. Ah, background. Um, there was mushrooms in the background. Looked up mushrooms. Of bones. I have no idea what any of that means. Might be for the best. It is emanating some black shit.
Run the ice rail and need a loot house. Want this rail? I'll remember it. Right. I don't know if I'm opening it yet. I mean, generally, if you find cursed item just sitting there IRL, you'd want to leave it alone. Um, generally, you know. No. Having a rave down here or something. You know? Dying. I thought we put all our money in the uh I must have earned quite a bit during the uh interlude between I put the money in the thing. No, no, you know. Humphrey! He actually responded in my direction. Yeah, we got some good loot out there. What could possibly go wrong? Yeah, a little bit finicky on the old Ah, it's raining slime, eh? Oh shit. Well that's a party, isn't it? Anyway, my friends, with this, I think it's time for me. Eh. You're not lie down. Enjoy the slimes. And um, see about clearing this up tomorrow, I suppose. Nothing I can do right now. You know? Simple. It's been a wonderful stream, though. Thank you so much for taking the time to enjoy it, you know? It's been an absolute pleasure. One, getting into the, uh, you know, endgame shenanigans of Noitera, but uh, also, you know, was it like the fourth day, 12 hours in to Terraria? Yeah, cheers, guys. Thank you for all your help. Thank you for your support. Thank you for enjoying the show. I will get back into it tomorrow, I am sure. It's been wonderful. Okay, so it really has. It's been good vibes all around. Again, the support to accelerate me into somewhere halfway decent, because I can see you actually really struggling with this game in a way. Of course, we have gone on the old uh, classic uh, medium expert, you know. <laughs> Straight away. Slime has stopped falling from the sky. Great! That's fantastic. Anyway. Night, night. Is the game still running in the background, even in the pause menu? 